Wow. Wow. Guys, this is very strong. <coughs> I'm sure it works great. But this is very, very strong. Woo. Wow. <coughs> and I wasn't kidding around when I <laughs> bought the strawberries. Oh, and I also bought some cashew cheese so these cheese are made from cashew and they use some probiotics so this is really yummy you guys this is awesome also I tried this shredder thingy and it works it works so well and this is so easy to gather with this little brush and I cannot tell I love this guys I love it so much and I'm just going to keep it up here because it's so pretty okay this is how far we got with the tasting <laughs> um, so I just mixed, mixed some maple syrup in there and I have to tell you this is exactly it has exactly the same taste as the Nutella like a hundred percent it's the same it tastes so good i cannot even tell you so, so i have a project for today the boys are just left for bicycling because i just can't keep up with them <laughs> they bicycle for hours and in a high speed so uh that's not for me <laughs> so the whole house is for me today and i also have to get ready for the scan fair so the today project if everything goes well we might gonna go to ikea and i wanna find a table that has a little drawer so i tried to, to do the art in the kids room if you have seen my previous videos you saw this one big length of a table and i think we would have a comfortable space however <laughs> my lovely boys <laughs> when they doing projects with their train or the legos i find some trains and lego pieces on my drying art <laughs> so i decided maybe it would be a better place to find something somewhere in the living room because obviously the dining table it's not gonna make it for me because i can't finish the project and it's it's no way i can pick it up and put away everything three times a day or four times a day as because we use this table three times just for eating and homeschooling and for other things i'm gonna do some decluttering and reorganizing now but before i start to do anything i wanted to show you guys how the bathroom turned out maybe i should turn it off yeah that's much better so this is how the light turned out and i think it fits really well the light it's really good i really like how it lights the room because it's um it's a consistent light it's not like you know when you see shadows so to tell you the system I did here so with art I gathered three piles the first one was the past and that was something that I've already done so it's either I, I just file them if I need to use them as a portfolio or I just simply I like to keep it the second pile would be the present that means all the projects that I didn't finish <laughs> that goes into one box so i have a box where i keep those that i'm working on right now 
and I also put all the pieces that I kept as an inspirational piece that I already done and and it's just undeveloped ideas so those are the things the second pile is for the present for the future this is a third pile i put all the papers that i can use in the future and all the things that i can print on so that would be the future and the fourth pile was to get rid of and that means um all the things that i don't think i'm going to sell or i don't think it's going to help me in my future work so i got rid of that it wasn't a big pile though but i have a bigger pile that i want to sell so i would say i had five piles there the selling things get rid of things um the past present and the future so these are the categories that i i uh, use for organizing my art and I also have another box that I didn't put up there because this is something I'm going to organize in the desk, in the drawer, or on the little shelf that I'm going to have above it. It won't go away. I've got that feeling rushing through my body. I know that it is here to stay. It's like you're my personal illuminati. Okay, so we are back from the IKEA. But I didn't record there because it's always like a zoo. But we got the table. And then here's the table. So hopefully somebody is going to put this together. Is there anybody who can put this together? We'll find someone. And I've got a blanket. It's a king size. And of course the classic. <laughs> I always have to grab that. So I opted with a table that has a wooden tone on the top and white on the bottom so from far it will look like it's kind of like a floating shelf and also because it's all kind of blends into the wall color it's will it will give you the illusion that it's a bigger space like nothing is there so it expands the view and it will feel more airy and bigger <laughs> Minimalism helping me to see more clearly what feeding my soul and who am I deep in my core. When I stopped hiding behind the busyness, that's when I truly become alive. This is minimalism to me, not counting the items, how many items I have, but what I get to spend my time on, things that are truly important to me. Family, health, self-care, and art, <laughs> and food. <laughs> 